welcome back as the sun shines upon a brand new day in Bodrum. This laid back atmosphere, the fresh air, colorful scenic beauty can put anyone in a relaxed holiday mood like I am right now. After a relaxing day at the hotel, today we are all set to hit the town and discover Bodrum, Turkey's premier vacation town. Come with me and together let's take a look at Bodrum. the magnificent bays of Bodrum, we now have the opportunity to sail with the wooden Wichyam yacht, Kurtzi de Kempinski. Get ready to discover and be amazed by the exquisite nature of Bodrum. Through the magnificent bays of Bodrum, we sailed on the crystal blue warm, tideless seas. Wide-eyed, I admire the exquisite nature of Bodrum every aspect of it and appreciated all the efforts that have been made to keep it looking this pristine and untouched. The Bodrum Museum of Underwater Archaeology in the Bodrum Castle of the Knight of St. John is not just a dusty collection of lifeless relics, but an original, creative and exciting experience. It's a trip back in time into the worlds of ancient mariners who sailed to meet their destiny shipwreck on Antolian shores or to the medieval age of knights who built this castle from stones that once were part of one of the seven wonders of the ancient world. The mausoleum of Halicarnassus, which sadly was destroyed by earthquakes in the Middle Ages, as a matter of fact, some of the remnants can be seen in London's British Museum. This museum is a crusader castle and it was built from about 1400 to 1500. It took 100 years to make it. But it has become, inside the castle, a shipwreck museum. They call it a museum of underwater archaeology. Our institute has excavated 10 shipwrecks along the coast of Turkey, and five or six of them are on display here. And a couple of the displays are stunning because one of them is a shipwreck that is 3,300 years old. And from this, you can maybe appreciate why shipwrecks are important, because we like people to understand that they're time capsules. When the ship goes down, if we are lucky, it takes with us the tools to repair the ship, the weapons to defend the ship, personal belongings, galleyware, the cargo itself, which usually will be these jars, which were to transport wine or olive oil. History and culture of any place is so important to preserve for future generations. How else would they know the beauty and richness of their place that their ancestors lived in? And the history of Bodrum is so carefully preserved. That is something to be applauded. Well, in Bodrum, the excitement never ends, and to our surprise, we bumped into Michelle Adams, the owner of FTV, who invited us to pre-party of the opening of Havana FTV Lounge, where we also met the mayor of Bodrum and his wife, and together we partied in style. Michelle, tell us, I mean, it's, I'm so excited to meet you. I always, always wanted to meet you. Ever since we've launched Fashion TV, I've been watching it. So it's great to meet you and have you on our show, High Life Dubai. Tell us, uh, what are you doing in Bodrum? Well, in Bodrum, this time we're opening the Fashion TV Beach Club, which is a beautiful combination of fashion, beach, swimming, and a big, and you start from morning to late at night. We have swimming pools, we have a, uh, you know, uh, clubs, restaurants, everything. And you're going to come and see it today. I will show you. And uh, we'll be happy to show it to your viewers and our viewers. <laughs> on 11,000 square meter area, the Havana Beach Club is open 24 hours and has nearly everything to please its customers. A rocking disco, shops, beauty hall and several good restaurants. 
people can enjoy the sun and sea during the daytime and get ready for a great night after a good meal as the DJ pumps the music that continues till morning. Thank you for inviting us for the party, both of you. Uh, lovely to be here. Tell, uh, we love Bodram. It's an um, amazing, amazing place. Tell us a little more about this place. The Bodrum, one of the best places in the world, also the, one of the most popular summer places of Turkey and also the one of the seventh wonder on the world is here in Bodrum. One of the most important principles of the Bodrum, the people live here, they don't uh, want to involve other people's business, you know, like they're so friendly, so modern and this is one of the most important things of the Bodrum. Bodrum has been the town of entertainment and the city of entertainment for years. People from from all over the world came to visit Bodrum for entertainment, for holiday, for summer, for swimming and for doing sports. Bodrum is a place for everyone. It doesn't matter how old you are, it doesn't matter what taste you have. So it depends on you, what you want. But there is a, a place for everyone on the peninsula of Bodrum. at the beautiful Marina Yacht Club right here in the heart of Bodrum. Other than being very popular amongst the tourists and the local crowd, the club offers amazing choices in seafood, Italian and international cuisine. Complemented by live music by the famous Istanbul Realism Orchestra. The ambience, the food, the music, everything is perfect. Like it's taken directly from a fairy tale. The Marina Yacht Club has been providing year-round service in Bodrum for many years now. The complex presents a unique atmosphere for residents and visitors alike, offering an array of original bars and restaurants which are immensely popular for sailors, writers, artists and in fact anyone who loves good food and good music amidst a chilled out environment. <laughs> 